What's up, Boomerites? How we doing? It's King Booma. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing okay. I was in the business of reacting, and in my feed popped up a Billy Connolly suggestion. This is Billy Connolly tells just about the funniest story ever. Now, this looks like it's on a talk show. I don't know what talk show it is because I don't recognize the other dude. But um, <clears throat> it hit me when I saw the suggestion. I haven't done a Billy Connolly reaction in a while. So let's check this out and see what this is all about. This, is, this won't be a long one. This was only about three minutes. So let's see what it's all about. One of the actresses brought uh, a fart machine. It's a sort of a glass with a little... Oh, no. <laughs> Oh no, this might be the earliest I've ever stopped a video. Is this going to be a story about farts? Because if it is, this three minute video might turn into a seven minute video. Okay, alright. Control yourself. A tea in it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I got one of those. And you <laughs> shove your fingers yeah, in it. Right. <laughs> and it's, it's fantastically funny. <laughs> <laughs> and, and one of the actresses was complaining because we were smoking cigars in our dressing room, you know, all of her plat and everybody, we're all blowing away there. And the, the smoke was going through the ventilator, and so this old actress was complaining until we went in with the farting machine, and Ollie stuck his bum in her door. And, did this <laughs> and she screamed with laughter, and thereafter we could smoke all oh, no. <laughs> the and, and you know Steve Buscemi, he looks like a serial killer, you know? Yeah. He's going to in the street like he's going to kidnap the children, you know? He's just, <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, Steve Buscemi, he's a great actor, actually. I really like Steve Buscemi. But he is one of the strangest-looking humans on the planet. That is true. If you don't know who Steve Buscemi is, look him up. He's been in some great things. Uh, most recently... I think the most recent good thing he was in was uh, that movie Death of Stalin, The Death of Stalin, which was really good. Um, but yeah. <laughs> and, and you know Steve Buscemi, he looks like a serial killer, you know? Yeah. People avoid him in the street like he's going to kidnap the children, you know? He's got that look. He's actually an extremely funny man, but we're all trying to do the best farts, you know? And I was trying to do those walking ones. They're tough. They're you know, very, very tough. You, know, you, you got to be seen. And you got you to you be careful. Uh, the wee ones. The yeah. wee. And I could never get it right. But he was doing the splits in midair. Ah. Oh. Would run and go. <laughs> as, as he... <laughs> oh man. And normally the director would say, I forgot right, okay, it was funny the first time, lads. Let's get back to it, but let's remember why we're here. Why we're paying you the big bucks. But no, Stanley Tucci's got a machine of his own. He was enjoying it in. It was the most joyful experience. Yeah, did you ever light him? I, but I had oh. a Roddy who was brilliant. I've tried, but I, I can't do, I, I can't fart just at will. I would love to be able to do that. <laughs> I'm and sure I, you would, Billy. I'm sure you would, dude. Oh, my God. can't raise one eyebrow. There's two things I'd love to be able to do. <laughs> All the things we wish because for. <laughs> just think how nice it would be to do both. You know, <laughs> flying into the air. <laughs> but, we, but I can't do it. But he, no, I can't. Well, you know, I, I read a story the other day. The viewers sent me a story about a lady who was in, in a restaurant waiting for her date to arrive. And uh, all of a sudden, just without warning, she let one go. And she was very embarrassed. The entire restaurant heard it. And she said to the waiter, stop that. He says, lady, which way is it heading? <laughs> well, you know, it's supposed to be true that at the coronation, the queen of the queen was saying the king of Tonga. Tonga? Yeah. That's right. And the horse farted. <laughs> and one of those carriages. And oh, the queen man. mother says to the king of Tonga, I'm sorry. And he said, oh, I thought it was the horse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> okay, all right, okay. Time, time, time. <laughs> now, let's remember why... <laughs> Childish, the most childish jokes, the funniest, vulgar. Thank you. Milton, they knew about stuff like that. Thank right, you. Let's not forget why we're here. Let's not forget why are we here. I don't know. 
Thank you, Billy. Yeah, that was... Um, I really like what he said at the end there. Um, now, I don't know if that's... Because the title of the video is Billy Connolly Tells Just About the Funniest Story Ever. I don't know if it's the funniest story ever, but it was funny. You guys know how susceptible I am to the fart jokes, so... Uh, <laughs> so it's always a laugh from Billy. It's good to see him again. I enjoyed that. All right, well... If you like that, like, subscribe, do whatever you want. I'm King Boomer. You guys have a great day. We'll see you in the future. All right. Stay safe out there.